How does 5-MeO-DMT and other psychedelics compare or contrast with traditional talk therapy? That's what we're going to talk about in this video. How does 5-MeO-DMT and other psychedelics compare or contrast with traditional talk therapy? That's what we're going to talk about in this video. So when we think about how talk therapy works, it's in the name, right? So when we're using talk therapy, we are using language to exchange ideas with a therapist, and the therapist is explaining concepts to us. And so we're really working in the conscious mind uh, because we need the conscious mind to form uh, words and to speak and to use language. And so we're working at a certain level that's very much an intellectual level of understanding. And so this can really help in certain ways to build a mental map of our personality, of what happened in our life and how that influences how we perceive the world. It kind of gives us like an intellectual understanding of ourselves. And this can really be useful for a lot of folks and it can help move the needle. But at a certain point, we, like, we just talk to a lot of people that come to work with psychedelics and in particular work with 5-MeO-DMT that have done 10 or 15 years of therapy and they feel like they can talk their way around their issues and they understand them deeply on an intellectual level but it's still not getting to the root of how they feel and I think that's where 5-MeO-DMT steps in. 5-MeO-DMT works on a completely different level in fact when you're at your highest dose of 5-MeO there is no mind there is no intellectual processing whatsoever there is a pure energetic process happening and so there's a lot of, um, well, it's, it's not actually that new, but finally I think psychology and the world of therapy is coming around to this idea that we store trauma in the body. And that in order to actually really heal and transform the way we feel and the way we respond to our lives, we have to be working on a somatic level. And that's what 5-MeO is all about. It's really working on a subconscious, unconscious, and somatic level. At the highest doses, there is this pure opening of the body, and oftentimes people are expressing themselves in ways like they are making tons of noise, or they are shaking, or they are um, thrashing around, they are laughing, crying, they're just expressing, it's pure expression. It's really just a pure energetic release. And there's often no specific connection to what, where that emotion or what, where that energy is coming from, but it feels incredible to have released it. And often people feel like they've lost 10 pounds of emotional weight after they just feel like they're floating. And they feel so much, it feels so much easier going back into their day-to-day -day lives without that baggage that they're carrying. And again, they may have been working for years to understand where that baggage came from and how it shows up and all these things, but, but psychedelic medicines, and in particular 5-MeO-DMT, just goes direct to the source. And I do think that therapy can often be complementary though because you know because 5-MeO is so direct and because it's such a fast and overwhelming experience for some folks you have this shift that happens on the somatic level but then the mind comes back online and it's got the same old patterns and it's got the same old thought processes and you need to build a new relationship and you need to start shifting your habits and you need to start Kind of finding context for what the, sh the physical and emotional shift that you feel you kind of got to build a new context with that and how to approach your life going forward so that's where i think aftercare for psychedelics is so important and that could be therapy it could also be coaching there's a lot of different ways to approach that um, i also think working with a somatic therapist which is more of a, a an embodied approach to therapy can be really helpful so anyway, I'll leave it there, but I think that's just some ways to think about the difference between how therapy works and how 5-MeO-DMT works. Hopefully that's helpful.